Moisture in your buildings and project materials can seriously affect your work. If you're working on drying out a flooded basement, your primary goal is to remove moisture from the walls and floors. If you are handcrafting wooden furniture, you need to ensure your wood stock has the right amount of moisture so that it can be formed and fitted properly without damage. For these kinds of requirements, a moisture meter is invaluable. A moisture meter is a basic handheld device that measures the amount of moisture present in a building material whether it's pressure-treated lumber, oak blanks, plywood, or drywall. Modern moisture meters have a digital readout that tells you the percentage of moisture in a material. Some also have a digital bar graph to give you a relative sense of moisture levels. Now there are two major categories of moisture meters, pin-type meters and pinless or non-invasive moisture meters. Pin-type meters use two electrode pins either on the meter or on a probe connected to the meter. Place the probes on the building materials to get a moisture reading. They're highly accurate for the specific spot being measured. Some also work with specialized probes that are made to penetrate through walls to measure moisture and insulation, or probes that go behind baseboards or other flush surfaces. The downside is that the pins themselves can leave pinholes in your material. Depending on your project, that may not be a big deal. If you're going to work on your materials either sanding, spackling, painting, or finishing, that may not be a problem at all. The holes will be concealed. If the damage is undesirable, or you won't be able to conceal it, you may want to think about going pinless. These newer pinless meters use a small flat plate on the back of the meter instead of pins. You place the meter directly on the surface to get a percentage of moisture reading. While pin type meters measure moisture just at the surface, or just below the surface, pinless meters like this XTEC MO290 measure a bigger area, also going much deeper, up to 3 quarters of an inch or 20 millimeters deep. So not only are pinless meters non-destructive, their ability to measure deeper into material is also useful for measuring moisture in concealed materials, such as plywood substrate behind ceramic tiles, for example. Between the two types of moisture meters, the number of added functions depends on whether you choose a basic reading-only pocket model or a more advanced multifunction model. Some allow you to select the actual wood type for increased accuracy. Some have data functions like minimum and maximum readings. There are also very advanced models that measure additional factors like air and surface temperature, relative humidity, grains per pound, vapor pressure, and condensation levels. Some pinless models also include a pin probe for dual functionality. One model from XTEC even transmits readings to a FLIR infrared camera in real time. From big construction or restoration projects to small wood crafts, if moisture can affect your materials, make sure you check first with a moisture meter.